Hey guys, so this is going to be my PlayStation collection video, and it's going to be split into two parts, um, because as I said, my PlayStation 3 and 4 games will be split into videos instead of together, um, because I record on my phone so I can only do so long, and I'm trying to, gonna try to make this quick, and I'm going to include the one PS2 game that I still own. I have some PlayStation 1 games somewhere, but I'm not sure where they are. But for those that have a wrestling game, I have a Spongebob game, and um, Bratz video game for PlayStation. Uh, so first I'm just going to show the PS2 game, which is Mortal Kombat Deception. And I got it for $10 at a video game store that sells retro games and old games and stuff. Um, I just got it because I never played it, but... Um, I don't really play it now, because I don't play my PS2, but, um, I still have that, and I have this, and it's pretty fun. Okay, so next we have the PS3 games, I'm just gonna go through them quickly, because I've kind of shown my favorites before, so. First we have Killer is Dead by Suda51, um, and it's Exceed games but the creator of Studio 51 who also did lollipop chainsaw and that game is pretty fun um i like it bayonetta i love this game uh i wish i still wish the second one would have been on playstation 3 as well but it, it wasn't but i have played that on the wii u and then we have Dead or Alive 5, which is a fighting game. Um, it's fun. Devil May Cry 4, and I don't have the original case since I bought it at GameStop. Pre-owned. Batman Arkham Origins, got it pre-owned as well, they didn't have the cover. Batman Arkham Asylum, I think this was also pre-owned, and it was like $6.00. When I got it. Um, same for Batman Arkham City, because I don't have the Game of the Year ones, unfortunately, but um, I would like to get the Arkham City one so I can have the Catwoman DLC and Harley Quinn's Revenge and Silent Hill Downpour. I haven't played this a whole lot. Um, I played it maybe once or twice. Silent Hill Homecoming, and this was a birthday present a couple years ago, and I played it some. Resident Evil 5, um, I played that and finally beat it after waiting so long. Um, Resident Evil 6. And 7 is actually coming out soon this month on the 27th, I think. 24th or 27th, one of the two. I think it's the 24th, and the new movie is coming out the 27th. Um, next, I'm going to show these. Uh, so we have Uncharted, Drake's Fortune, which I beat that not too long ago. Um, I also beat Uncharted 2, Among Thieves, Uncharted 3, Drake's Deception. So I beat the first three. I do have the fourth one, and that's in my PS4 collection, of course. Um, next we have JoJo's Bizarre Adventure, All-Star Battle, which is a fighting game. Um, it's also the Japanese version, so it's all, it's all in Japanese, <laughs> but I, I don't need to read anything to know what I'm doing. I just need to, it's a fighting game, so it's simple, pretty simple. Um, and we have Wet. And I like this game. As I said before, it's like a spaghetti western type game, and um, it's really fun. It's slightly repetitive, but it's really fun. And we have Yaiba Ninja Gaiden Z, which is part of the Ninja Gaiden series. I'm not sure if it's canon one, though. I don't think it is. Um, I'm pretty sure it's not, but it's fun. This one has zombies. In it. The Evil Within, I still have not finished this game, but I really need to. 
either way, it's a good game. It looks really good on PS3 too. Um, and The Amazing Spider-Man 2, which I've beat at least twice, I believe. It's fun. And there's also a new Spider-Man game coming out for PS4. It's an exclusive. God of War Ascension. There's also a new one of those coming out. I've been keeping up sort of on the games coming out. Um, Resident Evil Operation Raccoon City. Um, it's pre-owned. And it was like $5 so I picked it up. And it's pretty fun. Twisted Metal. I don't really play this a whole lot. I played it a couple times. And I'm terrible at driving in it. I crash into everything. Alice Madness Returns. I would have liked to have the cover for it, but again, I got it for cheaper, pre-owned. Um, because that's how I do things. So, Resident Evil Revelations. Mortal Kombat Complete Edition. Injustice Gods Among Us Ultimate Edition. Deadpool. This game is really fun. Um, it could have been better, but it's really fun. So I don't care. Um, I've played it a lot since I got it. Um, and it's just hilarious. That's the reason why I like it. Um, and because it's Deadpool. Assassin's Creed 2 DMC Devil May Cry and this was the Walmart exclusive edition and last we have Lollipop Chainsaw which is like one of my all time favorite games um, I platinumed it and I still play it to this day a lot so yeah um, so that's the first part of my PlayStation collection, and next I'll be doing the PS4 games. I have 11 games for that, um, 12 if you count the one that I have downloaded on it, which is JoJo's Bizarre Adventure, Eyes of Heaven. Um, so if you like this video, please let me know and give me a like and a comment, um, tell me what you want to see, and I will try to do it. So, thanks.